uh, I'll explain warp and woof because I think that's important for people to understand. Warp and woof are the vertical horizontal threads that make fabric. And so uh, because I'm a Christian and I think Christianly about all things, uh, this kind of comes out of a Colossians 1.17 idea that all things are held together by Christ, by the one who has made all things. So that's the reason for the title of this. And it might give you a sense of why I write about so many different things. Uh, because I'm interested in so many different things. So just recently I was at something called a transdisciplinary conference where a whole bunch of folks in philosophy and math and science and literature and theology were all talking to each other. Trans across disciplinary about your subject areas. I refer to myself as an interdisciplinarian because I'm very interested in finding out how what I think about interacts with what other people think about. And so I'm always reading uh, everything. And I would say that that's really powerful for any writer. Um, however we want to say this about writing, I would say this, that you will fail as a writer if you don't read. So if somebody says to me, what's the most important thing about writing? I would say, write, write, write. And then I would say, read, read, read. Because if you don't read, you won't write. And there won't be any substance to anything. And so what I find when I'm reading things like the New York Times, or the Washington Post, or National Review, or the Weekly Standard, uh, I'm all over the place reading all different kinds of things. Books are constantly coming to my house about any given subject area. You'd be amazed at the kinds of things that I read. Uh, but I'm so fascinated by everything in life. And hence the inter, that is the connection between the disciplines for me is important. And so Warp and Woof kind of grows out of that. There are five major distinctive areas in Warp and Woof. Uh, probably the most popular is the one that's called culture. Uh, people really resonate with the kinds of things that I see in culture around me. And uh, certainly my students do, uh, especially as it relates to films and movies and just everyday life. But about the website, I would say that it, it has a tremendous amount of content because I'm very interested in everything in life. <laughs>